So here we are. Um, I'm going to review this app. There's a couple different apps out there to calculate carbon footprint. Um, the free ones aren't all that great, but I did find one that's pretty workable. Uh, and that is this one. It's called Be Green. There's another one, VESCO2, that I like, um, but it's mostly geared towards businesses. So we're going to do this with Be Green. All right, Be Green. Um, basically, you, you've got some options here. Uh, to calculate electronics, food, shower, and transportation, the footprint from each of those. What I like about this app, it swipes back and forth. You can enter in your data. And so, uh, for example, transportation, uh, how many uh, minutes each day, um, what mileage, gas or diesel, and so you just click in the boxes um, and it will calculate it for you. And then you can uh, take this toggle here and change uh, how much mileage you get per um, per gallon. Now what's cool is it's in liters per kilo per 100 kilometers and I kinda like that. It's not like your typical miles per gallon that we're used to. It's more of a global scale and so that will force the students to do some calculation. Um, it won't make it so easy for them but I, I kinda like that. Um, another thing here, this is shower flow rate. Um, again, it's in uh, the metric system. Uh, the temperature of the shower and then it gives a total up here based on what you choose and again uh, this is another way that they can investigate so it's got the flow rate of how many liters per minute you can adjust that well that means students will have to go and experiment and see how fast their shower flows which I think is kind of cool interactivity uh, electronics uh, again toggles for each of the TV game or computer so they can go and they can figure out how many wattage each of those are and then how many minutes a day that they uh, use those electronics. And food. Um, again, some conversions here, grams per four, four ounces. So I like those four categories for kids and it gives them a chance to go out and do some exploration on their own. Now what, what's cool is at the very first swipe, it'll automatically tally. So the things I've entered so far, transportation and shower, I didn't enter any food or electronics, but they'll show up here and they'll give you a total equivalent per year based on those calculations. And it shows on the graph which is taking up their most or giving their most uh, footprint um, of throughout their life. So, so that's a cool little app, Be Green. It's a good little carbon footprint calculator. Um, it's not the end all be all because it only has these four categories, uh, but it's definitely a good starting point and a good conversation starter and leads to a lot of experimentation for students.